Hey guys, Jen here from Maine and Suds and Such and Be Scented. So I'm making a custom soap order um, for Marshmallow Fireside. And so I'm making a double batch, so I have some for me. And I'm going to do it very similar to the last time I did it. This fragrance discolors to what I call, it makes it look like a roasted marshmallow. You know how like when you just start roasting a marshmallow, it kind of gets that, that, like that caramelized color on the outside of it before you burn it? Kind of like that. So the colors that I do end up uh, being um, a little more brownish, uh, but they don't totally lose their color. They still have their color, but they discolor. So. I'm going to do white base, which is going to uh, discolor to like the burnt caramely color. And then I'll have black, which of course is going to stay black. And then I'm going to do red, which will end up turning a really deep red. And then some orange. Last time I didn't do orange, but I'm going to do orange this time. Kind of representing the marshmallowy uh, campfire. Um, uh, atmosphere. You know, your fire burning, your marshmallows, the orange from the flames, the red, you know, all that good stuff. Black, because it's nighttime. All the goodies. mix up our powders in here. Alright. Now we'll pour them over into here. I'm so glad to be back soaping for you guys. I did miss you very much. For anybody that ever wonders, I do miss making videos and anytime I ever make soap or anything and I don't record, I actually feel bad. It's like you guys know I'm not recording or something. <laughs> so I just make a habit of always recording. Fragrance. Make sure I got the right one. Oh yes. It smells so good. Don't ask me how they get such a good marshmallow scent. But they do. It's all the stick blending I'm doing. And three, right? Orange, red, and black, yes. Sorry, my arm's totally in your way. How did you do that? Let me see again. Just one wrong? Is that the memory one? <laughs> you suck. <laughs> I 
All right, let me move this better to where you guys can see what I'm doing. Just so y'all know, that was my husband. I didn't call my, tell my kids they sucked or anything, you know. That was my husband. I can tell him that. That sounds awful, doesn't it? <laughs> He's doing a test online and it's got a memory section to where they give you so many minutes to memorize a bunch of stuff and then it disappears and you have 20 questions you have to answer from the memory and he only got one wrong the best i've ever done is get like five right out of the 20. i have a horrible memory obviously he does not. Alright, so white going into this portion. Now, this orange is a very, very bright orange, but it will discolor. It will not stay this burnt or bright in your face orange. Now, with my reds, I do like to mix two colors, which is not like a red red, but to me, I like it. And our always famous black activated charcoal. Try to do a drop swirl. I'm not sure if it's thin enough. We'll try. Alright. 
Now maybe a couple of days before I can cut these. That'll be all right. And we'll do a thin layer of black. Do this all over again. Gotta do the white slow because this is a heavy bucket and it can come out really fast. Once you get your rhythm going with the right speed you need, it's not terrible. Alright, that'll be for the topping. Drop swirls are one of my favorite. This makes such a beautiful soap. together. Perfect. Now We'll do the black just because I don't like my tops <clears throat> overrun with black. But we can't waste any of the soap. Is it the same thing over and over again, or does it change? Huh? How did you do that? Not fair. I didn't see how this soap turns out. This soap smells so good.
Oh boy. It drops that on me. Get it just a second. I'm leaving the top just like that. All right, bring you back for the cutting. I'm back to cut my marshmallow soap. I just dented it. Crapola. So I have to fix that. Alright. Now, it's going to discolor darker. Not much. You can see. You see, you see it on the edge there? That's how it's going to discolor. colors. That's what I did last time and I really liked it. Just a few more. Last one. Alright guys, thank you very much for watching. I'll catch you on the next video.